Now, if you are bored of the regular keyboard you have, say, on your Android phone or your iPhone, then don't worry, because Google comes to the rescue with Gboard, their special highly customizable keyboard, which not only can change exactly how your keyboard looks, but also give it a bunch of additional features. Now, the first thing you're gonna do is download the Gboard app to enjoy all of this, and it can be found on both the Google Play Store and also on Apple's App Store as well. So that's right, you can enjoy all of these great features on both platforms. But okay, why would anyone want a third-party keyboard? I mean, it really does most of the things you'd want a regular phone keyboard to do, right? Well, don't worry, because Gboard has an ace or two up its sleeve. So when you start setting it up, you will first have to select what kind of layout you want, which most people most likely opt for QWERTY, but others are available, as well as the language packs you want to download. And that is already one of the big additions with Gboard. You know how, for example, on your regular Samsung keyboard, you have to swipe the spacebar to change between languages? Well, on Gboard, you don't have to do that. It automatically detects which language you're typing in and adjusts the spell checking and predictive text based on that so it is super simple to use if you are using multiple languages often on your device however that's not where the tricks end you can change how it looks with plenty of themes being available for you to choose from you can even have a different one every single day if you want to keep things fresh but of course that's just purely cosmetic it doesn't affect the usability that much what definitely does affect usability is the special one handed mode as well which adjusts the size of the keyboard to make it a lot more comfortable to actually use another neat feature is support for glide type Typing, which, well, maybe not everyone will want, but for those that do actually use this and it is the preferred method of actually typing, then hey, it is here for you. In order to access your numbers and special characters, well, you just click on a special number key in the bottom left. And to access all your emojis, GIFs, stickers, and whatever else you want to bombard people's text messages with, well, just click on an emoji icon in the bottom left as well. Then there's one more unique feature of Gboard, and that is its Google integration. By just tapping on that Google icon in the top left, you get access to, well, most things Google, including Google Images, so you can quickly find images and send them. Google translate so you can quickly translate stuff and send that and even stuff like YouTube so you can very easily share videos with others or Google Maps to quickly share locations. So you basically have a full-on Google browser integrated into your keyboard which is of course pretty useful and can save you quite a bit of time. Not to mention the fact you can also use a spacebar as a track bar as well in a way which is another very neat addition to Gboard. So overall it is a feature rich app and it is completely free to download on both Android and and iOS. If you have no qualms with your current keyboard, then odds are you probably won't need this. However, if any of those features do sound enticing, then you can give it a try. I mean, what do you have to lose? It is free after all. So I hope you found this video useful. If you did, then subscribe to How To Authority for more like this in the future.